right, here we are, Bahia Honda State Park, cabin four tour. This is the outside we brought kayaks, so our Hobies. And we attempted to launch them. Oh, there's a little lizard. Um, we attempted to launch them here from these rocks, which you probably could. Ours are very heavy, but you probably could launch small kayaks right here. Um, maybe depending on the tides or the seasons, but um, it was nice here. So we actually launched over there in front of those restrooms, and that was perfect. No swimming here in the lagoon, but um, you can definitely launch kayaks. And there's all kinds of fish right here. Um, we fished from here and caught a little snapper. And that's really about it. We more or less just hung out. Um, here's the patio for the deck. Comes with a picnic table. It's nice. Nice view. You have a nice view everywhere this park. There's a grill. We actually didn't use it only because we like to eat out, but um, it's a nice park style grill. I would definitely bring something to clean it with though. Um, and then you have this little area here for, Alan used it for storage, fishing storage. And you get two parking spots per unit. Um, so if you have more cars than that, I don't really know. I think they say two car maximum, but... Okay, so we're going to go upstairs. Oh, and there's the garbage and recycle bin. Going up to number four. We were here for a week, and it's, um... Let me say it's worth it. It's worth the money. It's worth the drive. We drove from Atlanta. This is the view from your from your deck. Very nice view. There's your little deck patio again, picnic table. There's your neighbors. You're close to them, but you know it's pretty private. That's their their deck. Um, it, the cabins are built in like tiers, so you're really not all up on somebody. You can see there's the other neighbors. There's only six total, so that's five and six. We're in four. Um, the only, we brought chairs. The only patio furniture or deck furniture they have is this bench, which is perfect, but um, we brought some more comfy chairs. All right, so here you go. Inside. Cabin. Check out 11, we're about to leave. And here you have the kitchen. Like I said, we don't cook much, but it seems perfect. We did make some hamburgers inside one night instead of dealing with the grill, and it was fine. Um, perfect for lunch, fridge, freezer, microwave, dishwasher, stove, tons of um, cooking stuff. There's some pans and colander. Another little table that's kind of handy. There again, we kind of used it for storage or bar space. Here is your view from your kitchen. Got a fridge, freezer, uh oh, he left his beer. <laughs> um, there's a broom. You don't really have to do much cleaning here, but um, it's kind of nice to sweep up the trash. And then they have plates and cups, bowls, and they give you like an initial setup of um, dishwasher stuff, um, garbage bag, sponge, that kind of thing. All right, here's the living room. There's a table. We didn't really get the table out. There's just two of us this time, but it, it actually will sleep six. So I imagine if you have six people in here. 
um, and you need to get it out, you can. So there's the chairs and the table. There again, we kind of used it for more storage. I guess we did eat there the one night. Sofa. Um, it does pull out into a bed. We didn't need it, but it does. And then here is another dresser. Um, I believe that dresser is for this left bedroom because there's no dresser in here. It's kind of a smaller bedroom, but perfect size for for here. And then there's a closet. Um, all the rooms have windows, but you don't get much. I mean, you get a view, but it's, you know, that's actually the very front of the state park. And you see the ocean, so that is a nice view, but... And we are here in December, so we kept the windows open most of the time, and I have to say, it was fabulous, because in Atlanta this time of year, you can't really do that, so I don't want to show myself in the mirror. Here's the bathroom, toilet, shower, combo, or bathtub, shower, combo, a little storage thing, towel rod. There's no hooks, so you might want to bring some hooks I kind of thought that might be a good thing to have over the door hooks. Um, here's the bigger bedroom that we used. There again, you have your view of the front of the state park. I guess that's a little bit nicer view. Um, and the closet. All the rooms have ceiling fans, which there again is nice. Another dresser. This view is not so great, but it was nice just to have all the windows and curtains open. Um, the beds are double beds, but it we're not used to that, but it, it actually worked. Um, so I think that's everything. Here is the air. Heat air. But there you have it. Cabin 4 by the Gia Honda State Park. December 2019 we've had the best weather um, you can actually if you do kayak you can bring your kayaks and like I said you can launch them right there um, we did it right in front of that bathroom but probably anywhere over there we just pulled the trailer and then we went out you can kind of go out with the full lagoon you can kind of go out from there um, left or right left you go to the Bahia Honda Bridge, um, over towards the campground. It's pretty that way though. Sunset way for us. We went over there to see the sunset. Um, we went to the right and that was pretty good fishing that way, marine life. Um, saw tons of jellyfish, sea turtle, sharks, <laughs> um, lots of stuff that way. So it's great fishing down here. Alright, hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks guys, bye.